Hey guys, welcome back to FedEx Gaming's Redstone Tutorials. In this tutorial, I'll be showing guys how to build a very simple fence door. Now, one of my subscribers sent me a message asking me to build something similar to Mumbo Jumbo's new Monster Mouth door. Now, I'll have a link to his Monster Mouth door in the description below. But of course, if you're on console, then you won't be able to build his design. Also, mine's smaller, so yeah. <laughs> so this design, this is actually very simple door, guys. So pretty much, we have a fence right here, and of course, we cannot walk through fence because it's impossible. <laughs> but if we click this button right here. What happens is our pistons will push up the middle pistons, I mean, we'll push up the middle fences, thus splitting them apart because nether brick fences and wooden fences cannot link together. So if we get out of fly mode and click this button right here, we can walk right through our fences. See? Click the button, just walk right through, and simple as that. So all it does is split the fences like so. Very easy build, guys. So let's just start building this thing. Now I'm going to be building mine the exact same size as this one. If you want to make it smaller, go right ahead. And it, of course, I'll show you how to extend it out if you want to make it much bigger than this. However, I'm going to be using the resources to make it this big. So for this build, we're going to need a nine by two spacing, and we're also going to have to dig down three. Now for this build, we're going to need eight regular pistons, four redstone repeaters, 17 redstone dust, two buttons of any choice. It doesn't really matter if it's wood or stone, one lever, 10 fences, eight nether brick fences, is of course or if you want to use uh 10 nether brick fences and eight uh wooden fences go right ahead and we're also gonna actually i actually want to get my get rid of my lever for now we're also going to need some blocks to put our redstone down i'm going to be using lime wool we're gonna need some blocks of choice for our walling and some blocks of choice for our flooring so once you got your nine by two spacing and you dug down your three come to the bottom left hand side and put a regular piston facing upwards like so put a block right next to it with dust on top of it then two blocks up from that with dust on top of this block and then take out your walling block i'm going to be using quartz and put a button on this side and this side so now if i click this that piston will extend up next what i want you to do is pretty much just come out from this dust right here with more dust and then wrap it this way and put more dust here and it'll make like a square right here but of course we're gonna have a block right here so we'll end up cutting it off in the long run then what we're going to do is take right off from this dust and just bring a line out like this all the way down to the end of your nine. So I'm going down one, two, three, four, five, six blocks. And of course, when we, ex if we extend it out, you're going to go much more than this. So what you want to do is come out with one repeater on one tick delay, then bring dust all the way down these blocks. Then the block right here in front of your one tick delay repeater, the block that's right in front of it, we're going to put a regular piston facing upwards, then skip a block, put another regular piston facing upwards, skip a block and put another one facing upwards like so. Next, what I want you to do is actually Actually, you know, you could test it out if you want to make sure everything's working. All right, I can see all the pistons are going up. So what I want you to do is take your floor block out and put a floor block right above every piston. Do not click the button. And then I want you to take whatever fence you're using. So I'm going to be using nether brick fence as my first fence, not wooden. And you're just going to put nether brick fences right along the tops of each one of these. Then in between them, you want to put your floor block like this. And there we go. Next, what we want to do is take out your other colored fence and just bring that all the way down each block. Then take out your other fence color again and then one more time we're going to take out our fence color a different fence color and bring it all the way down so we're pretty much gonna have three rows of fence see one two three and then the fourth rows will be intertwined like that next what you can actually do is take out your uh, block of choice and just wrap this around the fence like so do, 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 do. just wrap it around the fence and there we go now what we're gonna have to do is put our pistons up top so mine is only going eight high. You can make this much higher if you want to, but remember pistons can only push up to 12 blocks. So this thing's already pushing one, two, three, four, five, six. So I could put another six blocks if I really want to. So you can make it go much higher if you want to, but I don't really see the point of having to make this thing go that high. So right here off this piston right here that we have all the way back over here, that's nothing going to, I'm gonna delete this. We're gonna bring blocks up eight blocks above this piston. So one, make sure it's the color of your wall too. Make sure it's the color of your wall. So bring it up eight blocks. So one, two, three, four five six seven and eight like that so make sure it's exactly eight blocks and it's the color of your wall next what you want to do is put a block going off to the left hand side of it with dust on top of it and now we need our lever so take out your lever go underneath the block next to the block wherever you want to put your lever doesn't really matter i like going underneath the block and then just flipping it on because this dust needs to be on forever next what you want to do is come three blocks out from that one two three and we're going to put three repeaters here on four ticks delay so one two three all on four ticks delay then right off this block right here we're going to put a regular piston facing downwards right here and then we're going to pretty much just bring a row of blocks going all the way down this so bring a row up and then all the way down your fence not that far there we go actually you can go this far 
and then you just put dust all along them. So one, two, three, four, five. Next, what you're gonna do is what you did down here is just skip a block. So skip a block, put a piston facing downwards. Not like that, down, there we go. Skip another block, put another piston facing downwards. And that is it, you are, no, nope, you're not done. No, I lied, I lied to you. <laughs> Next, what you wanna do is put a block right above your four tech delay repeaters and bring them right over the tops of them with dust all along them. And then we're gonna put another normal piston, our last one facing downwards right here. Now we are done. So now if I click the button, it goes up and then retracts down. Very easy, guys. See, one more time. That goes up and then it retracts it back down. Very easy build. Now, of course, if you want to make it longer so you know it doesn't go this slow, like it doesn't go this fast where you have to go right in very fast, all you have to do is extend this part out right here. So you are done. You are completely done. If you want to stop now, you're completely done. I'm going to show you how to extend it out first. Actually, let's show how to extend it out. Literally, all you have to do is right here, just extend it out this way if you want to make it bigger, you know. It can go up to 15 dust. Remember that. That's how far it can go. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 14 15 like that so you can bring it all the way out this far and make it this uh long if you want to and then down here you just do the same thing as well you know just bring it all the way down 15 so let's see where's this one end up right there okay so we got it perfectly and then, you know just put it like this and then you can extend it out if you really want to like i said it doesn't really need to be this big though but you can make it that far so if i click the button all the pistons should go up and then down see up and then down see you can extend it out that far now if you want to make it so it doesn't go this fast though like right here goes like that and then that the reason why you made it go this fast is just so i could keep it as small as possible but if you want to make it go a little bit slower all you have to do is just delete this whole part right here like this and then bring this out more so i'm gonna bring it out let's say let's bring it out uh three more so one two three like that and then just bring dust down here then put your normal piston facing upwards, then come up eight blocks. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Put a block off to the left-hand side of it with dust. Put a lever underneath it, click that on. Bring more blocks out this way and then put the rest of them on four ticks delay. So put these all on there with four ticks delay on each one. Bring the dust down over here like that. And then put a normal piston facing downwards and that will make it much slower. So if I click this, it goes up. And then it goes down. See how much longer that took for it to go down? It took way, way longer. So up and then down. And the only reason it does that is because now we have more of delay on these repeaters. So that's the whole video, guys. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave it a like and subscribe to stay tuned with my newest videos. All right, guys. Peace.